On Tuesday, members of the media, including NBC, were invited to see and go aboard the huge aircraft carrier USS Ronald Reagan, over a thousand feet long and 20 stories tall, moored in Almacan Bay alongside two other U.S. Navy ships the USS Chancellorsville and USS Gridley, with another USS Howard on the way here, bringing about six to 7,000 sailors to visit Phuket until this weekend. On board the huge ship, which was named after the former president of the United States and costing 140 billion baht to build, with many more to equip, with over 80 aircraft inside and on the flight deck. There were also two Thai-born sailors, Tanan Tang Pradap Kun, 20 years old, and Joe Chotiwat Makaratat, 40, working on the ship and visiting Phuket for the first time. The ship even has its own newspaper and TV station. A press conference was given by Rear Admiral Scott Hebner, commander of Carrier Strike Group 7, based on USS Ronald Reagan. He talked about this Phuket visit being their favorite stop, their goodwill generating a community service projects, and described to us this largest nuclear-powered aircraft carrier and his other ships and joint training with the Royal Obviously, Thai Navy. The, uh, USS Ronald Reagan is the centerpiece you know, with, the, with the air wing that you see around here in the hangar and up on the flight deck. We also, as part of the, the Ronald Reagan strike group, are the cruiser USS Chancellorsville, who is, who is anchored here in the harbor with us, uh, USS Gridley, which is a destroyer who is also anchored here uh, in the harbor with us, USS Howard, who is a guided missile destroyer, she'll be joining us here in a couple of days. She's uh, been, been behind us, finishing up a mission uh, over in the Indian Ocean. And uh, other ships, USS Thatch, who's a frigate, USS Decatur, who is a destroyer. They are still on station executing missions over in the, the Gulf of Oman and the North Arabian Sea. So no submarines? No submarines with us. Okay. And just summarize the power of the ship. How powerful is it? We know we have a nuclear engine. Uh, Describe the, that. Uh, I mean, the power is the propulsion. Obviously, yeah. the, the propulsion are uh, uh, nuclear reactors, and then I'll let the captain talk about that. Uh, but as far as the armament, the primary, you know, armament and power of the strike group is the air wing itself. Uh, and it's in a strike group. Strike group, 2 and we've been over in, uh, off of uh, Pakistan and, and doing operations in Operation Enduring Freedom, and that's primarily been the air wing, uh, and, and that is the main uh, strength, as it were, uh, of the strike group. But the other ships are also uh, the are in the pilot. And uh, as, as far as the power of propulsion, uh, we, ha we have the, the two nuclear reactors here that provide the propulsion for the ship and then also provide the, generate the steam for the electricity and all the other systems. Just got to love a man in uniform.